Morning guys, it is now 12 p.m. I slept for a very long time, so I feel very refreshed. I don't know about my sickness getting better, but I'm gonna say it is, <laughs> just so that I can feel that there's progress. Today's plan is to go to two YouTube events. The first one is a screening of a movie called Valerian, and the second one is right after that, and it's gonna be a class with Luke Besson, the director of the movie Valerian. So let's go. Got my face on and ready to go. But first, before I head out to the YouTube event, I have to go to UPS, which is UPS, and send this off to my friend two days because when she was here, she forgot her bag and her keys and most importantly, her Louis Vuitton. <laughs> so very important, gotta send it off. Lego. the Valerium screening and I passed by Starbucks and look they sell beer now it's crazy I am at the cinema Cinemark let's go So even though it's kind of nice to have like the nostalgic feeling of popcorn and everything here but honestly popcorn is like so overpriced at the movie theaters it's ridiculous I mean at the store you can get one pack full of like maybe 10 or 20 for like I don't know ten dollars but here you're getting one for like 10 12 dollars it's crazy but I guess it's just for for the fun and the movie experience. Maybe I should do it since I've never really had a movie experience. Yeah, so try something new and uh, YOLO, I guess. Let's go get the movie food and get the whole movie experience. Let's get some popcorn. Rip me off. Is that a large popcorn? Yeah. Pack on that butter. <laughs> if I'm gonna pay a lot of money for it, I'm gonna get the whole experience. Nice and finger licking. <laughs> we have oh, got my nachos, but don't forget the jalapenos. Ah. Ready for movie time. This whole thing was 20 bucks, $22. It's okay, YOLO. Just checked in and I got my 3D glasses. Let's go. Last question for a lady. Okay, for men. <laughs> yes. So, um, one of the things that really got me into this movie is, like, I'm colorblind and uh, it has a very unusual color palette that I can see very well because of the saturation of its color. My question to you is, what inspired you uh, for your color palettes? Uh, try to uh, not not only to be different, but to be positive. It's very funny because you know the the past is written, the the the, the present we have to deal with it. The future is a white page. We can do whatever we want. And as a moviegoer, I'm I'm kind of surprised the last few years to see. Uh, all this sci-fi film where it's raining, it's dark, and the hero is like wondering what he should do it or not. And I, I don't mind one once in a while, but now it's just like dark and dark. So my first motivation with the color was like, 
happy. <laughs> you know, let's write a future with some hope, otherwise I'm going to kill myself. <laughs> so it, that's why it's bright and colorful, and you will see the first world that we see, the, the world of Mule, with the pearls. It's, it's just like where I would love to live, in fact. It's, it's just a pure paradise. I can see the scene in, in loop, in fact. Just like this. <laughs> so gorgeous. So thank you so much to come today and have fun. All right, just finished watching the movie Valerian, and it was an okay movie, not too bad. There were some love scenes that make me kind of <laughs> nervous, and uh, I, it makes me, I, I don't know, something about people kissing and love scenes and cheesiness that I can't deal with. So without that, then the movie would be better. <laughs> anyway, and now I'm heading to YouTube event number two, which is to meet the director of the, um, the movie Valerian, or hear him talk about it. Also, the movie was 3D, so it kind of made me feel a little bit dizzy. Something about the glasses or the way that it is is giving me a massive headache right now. Like, my eyes, it took a while to adjust, and the aftermath is not cute because I'm getting this migraine right here, and I hope it goes away before, before tonight. Or just go away <laughs> forever. Last night I had to tap out from the YouTube event a little bit early because um, after watching Valerian in 3D, it gave me a massive headache and I could not, <laughs> I was just feeling really nauseous so I couldn't stay for so long. So I left and then I went home and I had to sleep it off because it was so crazy in there. Which kind of sucks because that means I can't be watching um, 3D movies anymore because it's not making my head or my brain like happy. So, anyway, thanks for watching, and don't forget to subscribe and like, and check out the movie Valerian. It's coming out July 21st. I look Besson.